Welcome back people, we've got some more Ark Survival Evolved for you guys here today. We are on Fajora map again, and today we're going to get a little bit busy. I'll say busy, I'm laying down in bed here. <laughs> Anytime I do live streams, I'll always use the face on the mic for videos. I randomly hit record, and that's how we always get those awesome video clips. I'm not really sure what's actually going on here. But uh, we've, had, we've had a couple of teammates come on and they managed to get hold of us i don't know who it was but yeah one of the teammates have got on and they managed to get hold of a male rex they said it's not the highest level but it's still a male we've been having a problem trying to get a male so we got given that female rex so then this is the one that i tamed that's 256, that's becoming an absolute tank. We are playing on official server, just to mention that, so the stats that you see are original and stuff like that. 13,000 health, 409 melee there. That's, yeah, that's absolute decent, that thing. And then this one is the male, I'm guessing, yeah, so that's level 73. Yeah, he did say it wasn't the, the highest level, but I don't mind it too much. It's better than nothing, because... I spent a long time trying to look for a male Rex and every one I kept seeing was below, I don't know, below level 10 or whatever. Yeah, and I didn't see anything higher than a 15, I, was, I remember that much rightly. Is it glitching? Yeah, it's glitching. Alright, anyway, we are now, what is this? This is episode, episode 10. Yeah, episode 10. And today, I have levelled up. And I haven't put the point in yet because I want you guys to see what I'm going to be doing. So I brought you guys back for another video. Let's have a look. Uh, there you go. So it's what I want to do. I want to level up my player, of course. So I'm just going to. What shall I do? I've got 110 water. Let's give 110 in food. So now I'm level 88. I've been waiting for this. Oh boy, I've been waiting for this. Alright, we're getting there. Hold on. Rolling down. There we go. There it is. The cryo fridge for the cryopods. Oh man, I really did need that. Do you know what? It's nowhere near as much as what I thought it would have been. Yeah, that's actually cheaper than the uh, CB. Yeah, chemistry bench. Anyway, the 225 metal, 15 electronics, 60 polymer. Let's do that. So electronics, polymer. Oh, I'm gonna have to put some of this. I'm gonna have to put some onto the bird, aren't I? I forgot how much metal it was. It was 200 and something. Well, oh, come on, bubbles. Get you. I haven't been asleep. <laughs> Out here making that that awesome content. Uh, 225, okay. 225. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to, I'm not gonna be able to carry. Let's, let's drop that onto the bird for a minute. Yeah, I'm just gonna transfer everything there. And the, the animals that we were breeding, they're coming along quite nice actually, if I'm honest. Look at that. Uh, this is the one that we did breed. It's got, got a little bit of uh, levels there already. So I haven't put anything into any of these at the minute. And look at the melee already. 248 on that. That's actually pretty good. I need to get its health up a little bit. So this one's level 89. And look at this one. 274. That's insane. 274 melee. <laughs> wow. The Desmondus is, that's, uh, that's going to be my strongest bird, that one. That's level 96. So we've got some other birds in here. I oh, don't know really what is happening. Yeah. <laughs> and we've got the, the good old Gatchas as well. We've made videos on taming those. And, well, everything we've done, every, every progress that we've done through this game, me taming and me gathering resources and stuff it's been a it's been a little bit of a grind but it's not too bad because normally i would do the grind alone but for the fact we have teammates really does help 
this beaver helps a lot the uh, good old stone smasher as well all right so i think i've got everything for it now yeah i've got the metal there uh how much metal did i have on there okay so that gives me 280 we've got enough all right so let's hop down let's open up the door so we've got to go make this fridge we can't make it on us we can't make it in our inventory we can't make it in a smithy we can't we, yeah we just don't matter what we do we have to go to a supply drop a loot crate drop or another option is if you live right near the red ob you can just go there as well <laughs> now it doesn't matter if you don't if you're not near the red ob you can always go to the green or the blue one or whatever as well it's not they all work the same well, i'm gonna go there i'm gonna make i'm definitely gonna need more than one fridge that's that's a fact i'm definitely gonna need more than one but for now i just want to do one i've worked on getting a ton of crystal as well so the crystal situation is looking good means that we're going to be able to end up doing a greenhouse i still need probably a little bit more crystal so that's what i will do is uh, in another video in another video we'll, we'll build the greenhouse is that scorpion going to come up to me i think it is isn't it Oh, okay, bird needs to be closer anyway. So I can grab the stuff off it. There we go. I should really just kill that scorpion. Okay, it doesn't matter now. It's fighting the uh it's fighting the stone smasher. Well let's grab crystal, metal, polymer, and electronics. There we go. Access. and craft as simple as that there we go now i'm gonna head into base i'm gonna make uh, an outlet i'm gonna make some cables and stuff i know i've already got some of the cryopods already i don't know how many i've got but i know i've got a few of them i probably don't need to really make up many just yet but I am going to start putting dinos all in fridges because it's going to get crowded around here and it will just absolutely lag out like crazy. Just going to figure out where about we're going to put this. I'm probably going to... Maybe right here is good because it's close to the door if I need to... If I need... Yeah, there's... Yeah, there is actually perfect. I'm going to leave that there. All right. Yeah, there you go. We got some there. We got 25 days before they self-destruct. <laughs> but now I can keep them in the fridge. I ain't got to ain't got to worry about that now. So that's good. All right, I've cleared up that a little bit. What have we got? Any in here? I don't think so. So as you can see, we just, yeah. I need to make more ceilings, I need to make more slopes and more more of those uh, corners. But once I've done that, <coughs> yeah, for the the uh, the next one, I'm definitely gonna definitely gonna be working on doing the greenhouse. That that's gonna be episode eleven, I reckon. Okay, let's drop all of those into the fridge that way they can recharge up there you go can just drop those in there for now it's a shame with the rg you still can't fly them even after the patch updates they still yeah i don't know if you're ever going to be able to fly them on on this map by the looks of it it might not you might not be able to a little bit of a shame I do love a good old rg but not to worry. Uh, I'm interested. Is the multiplier still on? Is it still? It's still three times harvesting and taming and stuff. That's what I'm interested to find out. Because if it is, it's going to make my life a lot easier trying to get crystal. Uh, let's pick it up. Yeah, free. Nice. Okay. Well, that's that's good to know. Oh yeah, and a couple of other 
of our tribe members managed to finally get some dung beetles as well. That was a little bit of a pain. I, I got this one, and then the other three come from, <laughs> yeah, whoever got them. <laughs> but they were a little bit of a pain because they're not hard to tame, but every time I went to go to where they are, to try and tame one, there was never one around. But the good thing is, now we don't need to, I haven't even bothered to put down an oil pump anywhere because everybody's already hogged it up. That's what happens on a official server. And everyone's locked them. And there ain't really much oil around unless they go underwater. And I haven't worked on any underwater dinos as of yet, which I will definitely be doing, but I just haven't done that yet. So for that fact, I'm definitely going to... I'm gonna have to tame something from the water. This is crazy though. I want you to see this. This is this is really helpful. They've had this free time taming on for a short minute now. Oh, I'm definitely happy to speed it speed up my game process. I'll tell you that. 384 stone. And that was just just from one rock. Normally I roll up like this, I go outside the gates and I just collect around near the base. I don't have to go very far at all. And this stone smasher gets absolutely full of stone <laughs> to the point where I have to even drop some because <laughs> it gets encumbered. Its weight is pretty good though on this one. My weight is at 712 and the stone, even though it's 100, it's 12.5. But that's on on this diner, on yourself, it's heavier than that. It makes it a little bit lighter on this one. Oh, you're gonna. Oh, I ran out of stamina, that's why. I wonder if I can. I'm interested to find out. If I can do it, then I'm gonna do it right now. Uh, I don't know if I can. I wanna see if I'm able to build a chemistry bench. I know I'm definitely high enough level but I don't think we quite got the materials. Let's have a look. Uh, let's drop that onto one of these. That'll do. I think I need two, 250 electronics. I think that's Okay, I got 200. Oh wow, okay. We might be able to make a chemistry bench. I think we can. Yeah, we can. We've got everything. It's all we need is spark powder. Alright, we're doing it. We're doing it. Let's do it. Um, let's take all of that out of there because I ain't going to need that anymore. I think there's spark powder there. Oh no. One of these. One of them. One of them did. There we go. Alright, let's we'll switch that on. Well, we're getting things done here today. Alright, let's do it. I also want to make more safes as well. So what do we need? We need some metal and we need some cement and paste. I've definitely got cement and paste. I've already made one safe there. Um, the question is now, where in the world? We're gonna. I'll probably put the bench actually, kind of near here. It's not a bad idea, is it? Maybe, maybe there. Uh, yeah, that. That's ideal, like that. All right, there you go. We've got our chemistry bench. Perfect. I need to. I definitely need to make more safes. So right grab a bit of metal. Have we got some in here? Oh wow, I've only got 20. What about in here? Oh, no. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we want. Some of that good stuff. Let's turn it on. I need a paste in my here. I'm sure. Yeah, we've got plenty of that left. I've got so much stuff on me. Let's 
still over to here because now the chemistry bump is going to make all of that stuff. So I can just drop that like that. There we go. And then we'll come over to here, back to the fab. And let's make another state. Now the oil, we haven't got loads of oil, but we're definitely starting to build some up now. Right, so I've got two safes there. Turn that off. I've got to try and leave everything out of there. That ain't heavy, is it? Not really. Let's get rid of that. And then this one. Oh, that's going to be the heavy one. That is the heavy one. Um... Okay, 16. Uh, let me take some stuff from this one. Like that. Put as much as I can in there. And we'll fill that one up. Take the safe back. Well, that stuff's not really that heavy. That's not too bad either. Most of it's the spark powder that's heavy there. Oh, and the pout. Oh, no, I'm dropping all the light stuff. <laughs> there we go. Right, so that one's empty. That one's full. And this is the one that's going to be the heaviest. Take all of that. Transfer. There we go. Grab that. And then let's get rid of that one. Now I should be able to fit at least one safe. There you go. Perfect. Right, so I'm going to put that one down. And then all of that we can just dump into there. Is it glitching? Yeah. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright. I'm going to grab everything out of that one put everything into that one and I'll grab the safe in a minute oh, that one there we go uh, now I should be able to have enough room to fit this one beside there we go perfect and this first one I'm going to pick up the wood and any thatch but everything else yeah all of that that's okay. That stuff's gonna go in there. And then all of this stuff here can come out. Go into this one. And we've got a lot more storage. As the boys were saying that uh, they're getting a little bit tight on storage. <laughs> I fixed the problem. And we've still got room to put down another safe. Not that we really need to, but. Uh, no, there's no point if there's, yeah, there's no point we put another one. There's 91. Ah, uh, let's make it. We can do it. I'm on today, so whoever collected this metal out of our tribe members, thank you very much. I will replace it. Uh, there you go, one of those. So I've now unlocked all the scuba gear as well. That's all, that's all unlocked. I haven't crafted none yet, but it is all unlocked. Let's get that. That is perfect. That's what we needed. That's definitely what we needed. 100% more space. I'm pumped up points into weight on that one. What about this one? 487. 506, yeah, that's pretty decent as well. All right, so we now got a chemistry bench, we've got a fridge, we've got safes. We've, we've got we got this space up and running. Oh yeah, somebody also made some more fridges as well. So, oh, okay, let's quickly grab these. The boys told me to keep on grabbing that poop and every time you get a chance to, a free moment. Oh quickly drop it onto those that way we keep getting the fertilizer fertilizer built up and at the same time get that oil stacking 
I'm gonna quickly um, most of that or pretty much all of that is not really needed. There we go. Right, let's have a look over here. Hopefully no alphas here today. I find that quite surprising how quiet it is. Maybe someone done a meat run. Yeah, I don't see I don't see nothing around. I'm gonna quickly Oh wow, that did make me nervous there. I wondered what that was for a second. <laughs> I'm going to quickly gather up some metal just because I want to show you guys how good it is with the free time of taming but I also want you to see that with this metal that was I am replacing it I need quite a bit of it because I, I did use quite a bit didn't I this bird is getting getting quite jacked though two and a half thousand health I think is absolutely plenty for this, this bird as long as you're not trying to fight Alpha Rexes. And obviously you can kill off the Alpha. The Alpha Rex is perfectly fine with that. I wouldn't attempt doing it with a Rex though. Definitely not. So there's enough, yeah, there's enough health on this bird. There's enough stamina. And the weight. Yeah, I probably... Probably wouldn't mind that little bit more weight. <laughs> But it does the job. It gets the job done. Now we'll hit this one. Now then I'm probably gonna be probably gonna be full so I'm gonna be just a little bit over six hundred that I can carry then I think. Two six thing is there. Whoops. Oh there's a big metal rock there. Well, let's hit this one. probably gonna end up getting too much and then I'm gonna have to drop some oh, that's too heavy let's drop the stone seed yeah there you go so that's 300 and that's 612 raw metal I can carry and you can see my bird is slow <laughs> I do I still do have yeah I still do have a couple of bits drop that there you go I'm going to hold on to those extra arrows. I don't know why, but every time I kill alphas, I always do pick up them arrows. And for no reason, I keep dropping them all the time. And I shouldn't, because I'm obviously making arrows for the giggers and stuff. I shouldn't keep dropping them when I can get them for free. It doesn't really make much, much sense, does it? It's probably because I only get a few at a time. Anyway, I think that's going to be... Oh, that's going to be pretty much it for episode 10. As I said, for the 11, episode 11, we're definitely going to we're gonna work on the greenhouse. Get the greenhouse all built up. I don't know what someone's building there. But, you know, they've added something on. I don't know. Can't explain what. But anyway, I'll let them do whatever they're doing. <laughs> I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on the next episode of Art. And make that like button if you're enjoying Art as well. Don't forget, if you've got any tips or tricks on the game at all, you can leave it in the comment section below. Or even if you want to ask something. I do always try to respond to every comment. Not always possible because sometimes it can be a little bit difficult. But I always do try to respond to everyone. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. We'll catch you people again soon with some more fun and games. I am out.